An extended technique is any way of playing an instrument outside of traditional methods. Here are a few of the most commonly used extended techniques, which we can group as polyphonic, air and percussive techniques. Polyphonic techniques are multiphonics, singing through the instrument while playing. Air techniques are air notes, circular breathing and overblowing. Percussive techniques are double tongue, slap tongue and tongue grind. Multiphonics are largely dependent on effective tube lengths and vibration modes, emphasizing various overtones in the harmonic series by changing the internal structures of the vocal track and the use of cross fingerings. Singing through the instrument while playing. It is possible for a voice and instrument to sing and play either the same or different notes, and for both to move independently one of another. Air notes. Inhaling and exhaling air effects through the clarinet are possible with or without determining the intonation. These two techniques give different color airflow. Circular breathing is achieved by blowing out into your instrument using air you have accumulated in your cheeks while simultaneously breathing in with your nose. Overblowing is a controlled squeak sound produced by playing any note by blowing just hard enough to produce more air and force than normal but not enough to produce an accidental squeak. Double tongue is most commonly used technique in playing the fast passages separated by tongue. Double tonguing is alternate between using your tongue on the clarinet reed and closing the back of your throat to stop and start airflow. Think of saying ta ta instead of ta ta ta. Slap tongue is the best as a bass clarinet effect, comprising violent release of the tongue creating a slap as the vacuum is opened. Key clicks are rattling instrument keys, noted with X-shaped note heads and verbal instruction. Relatively quiet on clarinet, but quite effective in the low register of the bass. Tongue ram is a forceful explosive percussive technique that is obtained by pushing air out of the diaphragm and then stopping the tongue on the reed under strong pressure during the inhaling and exhaling. 